Hey, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Akira Janae, and thanks for joining me in this video today. Um, by the title, you see that I'm going to be trying out water coloring. I seen it about a month ago, so I wanted to try it, and I'm about to try a new color. I usually always do red, different shades of blonde, and uh, I've did orange before. So I'm gonna try to get a perfect navy blue color, if I can do that. And I ordered, I ordered this hair myself from a company called Supernova Hair. I got a 16 inch closure and I got 20, 22, and 24 inches of bundles. I'm recording this in my room. I would have done it in my kitchen, but it's not really good lighting downstairs. Excuse me. I have to do it upstairs. This is the 20, so 24, 20. I mean, that's 22, this is 20. So yeah, I'm very excited. This is 20. I've already filled my bowl up here. I got this little plastic container from Dollar Tree for a dollar. And this is just gonna be my dye-in bowl, I guess. And I already put warm to hot water already in here, but I did boil some downstairs. So I'm about to put that in here now. Always pour the water away from you. I am gonna use gloves just because I got my nails done last week and they're ombre like a yellowish color so yeah these ain't about to get messed up at all honey so got my gloves on look too big whatever and i am going to do a strand test sterile i'm gonna cut off a piece of this bundle And I would want to use something plastic. I watched a couple videos and a couple people was like, it's better to use something plastic. Okay. I'm actually going to turn it over and use the applicator part because I see it kind of stuck to the bottom of my thing. So a napkin first, just kind of see. That's how it'll look. Okay, so now moving on to the actual strand test. <laughs> um, I inserted a clip of how the strand test actually looks. Um, it didn't really show up on the camera really good, so I just inserted the clip. But yeah, I really liked it. So moving on to my first bundle. This is, I think this is my longest bundle. Um, I was kind of scared to dip it in there, but I just went ahead, soaked it all the way down there, as you can see. And I didn't want to put the roots in just yet, but I just decided to dunk everything down in there and making sure that I get every single strand because I don't want any blonde showing in this hair. So after trying to use it with the applicator brush, I just went through and kind of finger combed it with my fingers. And I didn't want this hair to be like a light color. I wanted it to be kind of, you know, on the darker side. So the more you dip the hair into the water, the darker it will get. If you want your hair lighter, then, you know, don't dip it as much. And I used the, I think I used the whole bottle of the Royal Navy dye. Okay, so moving on to my second bundle. I'm just going to repeat the exact same process that I did for the first bundle. Just making sure I dip it in there a lot to get the you know, a darker color that I want personally and just finger combing through to make sure I don't see any blonde and just dunking the whole bundle into the water. So for my closure, I'm not gonna lie, I was kind of scared to dunk the, you know, whole closure in there or get, you know, most of the lace in the water because I was scared that it would tint, turn blue, mess up the closure, everything like that. But I decided just to dunk it through there. 
Um, my knots wasn't bad. Like, it didn't tint the lace blue or anything like that. And I didn't bleach my knots prior to doing this. And I didn't bleach my knots after. And at the end of the video, you'll see that, you know, it still worked out perfectly fine without even bleaching a knot. So, you don't always have to bleach your knots. But my um, stylist, she did put um, concealer or foundation or something just on my part. So, I mean, it all worked out great. But just finger combing through to make sure I get everything. And here... I had a little bit left in my last bottle, so I just went ahead and poured all the dye into there. I went back and dunked my closure and my three bundles into the water. So just to make sure that, you know, it was dark enough of how I wanted my color to be. My bundles came out perfect. My only concern was my closure. I completely freaked out, but my hairstylist was like, girl, once I put it in and, you know, curl it up and everything for you, it will be fine. And she was right. I was completely feeling myself. Like, this color looks so good on me. I was in love. Like, you can tell me nothing, okay? Period. <laughs> but if you end up doing this hairstyle, you know, tag me in your pictures that you post so I can see. But... I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until my next one, I will see you then.